What is up guys, Flossy Missiles here. In today's video, we are at my Uncle Scott's house and my Uncle Scott has two Vanigans. One of them he's converting to a synchro, so four wheel drive. What do we got going on, Scott? I don't know. <laughs> started cutting up the perfect van for some darn reason. Yeah, this I mean, fan was like beautiful condition. It was insane. Inside and out, like literally beautiful. Subframe out of drop of rust. And for some reason, I don't know. There's a sick thing inside me where it makes me just cut up perfect cars. Anyways, so uh, looks like uh, it's getting pretty serious. The subframe's coming out. Is this, is this the synchro subframe? Yeah. Oh, wow. So I was setting it up there just to see. Did you drill out all these spot welds? Wow. Yeah, he ended up buying a donor van, a full uh, synchro conversion pretty much. I had everything he needed. Yeah, except money. <laughs> the biggest part, the money. <laughs> but uh, yeah, this fan is crazy nice. Even the paint on it is just like super clean. Used to be. Yeah, he, he's doing some work right here, even making it prettier than it already is. He also has an 85 uh, Westie, just like mine. Same exact model. That has a Subaru 2.5 in it. Yeah. And that thing's super quick too. Super clean as well, but a, unfortunately a palm tree. Was it a palm tree that fell on it? Palm yeah, a palm tree. tree fell on it. And a driver with no insurance. And a driver with no insurance hit <laughs> it as well. Super sad because that van was super clean. But this is an awesome replacement, especially after it's four wheel drive. That's going to be so sick. These are all parts? parts yeah, oh gosh. Brakes. All okay. stacked up over here. <laughs> all these Dude, look at these hubs. Knuckles. Wow, this is the synchro tranny? Yeah. So yeah, I cut those and then I hammered them up flat and made the frame like solid again instead of welding on plates there oh, okay and then i was just test fitting it sticking it up a little bit yeah. interior is super clean it's got a lot of stuff here so it's kind of cluttered but as you can see look at that look at all those cabinets and fridge and stove and all that another stuff has like scratches on it door panels are like perfect this is the synchro steering rack you have to remove it off the other car and it's like welded on there everywhere <laughs> Cut off so, a million spot welds and yeah, a million spot welds and just hack the whole van up just to get it off. Wow, but it's good as gold, really. So, after he gets everything all mocked up and ready to go, he's gonna shin it, send it off to get sandblasted. Yay, powder coat it too, or no? Yeah, hopefully, powder, powder coat it metal eyes. I'm not sure, just black, black, yeah. probably just do like teal or something. <laughs> Wow. Pink to purple. Do it. Barbie. <laughs> Barbie van. What is that? This is a brag of the cross member for the frame. Oh gosh. The linkage and everything goes through there for the shifter and everything. Cutting that yeah. off. Take all these welds off the van and cut it out. Too much fun. This is the front differential for the synchro. It's large. This is my hand. <laughs> That is crazy. It looks like a blower. Like this looks like where the belt would go. Wow. That's a huge differential. It is. Scott was just saying he's probably only put like 100 miles or less on this thing. That was 70. <laughs> <laughs> Since he's owned it, he's already done the, the four wheel drive conversion. That's crazy. But anyways, he's hooking me up with some bay window, uh, camper windows or the Jalousie style windows, a three vent. And they're gonna go on the yellow van because I don't know if you guys have seen my yellow van, but my windows are shot. So I'm stoked on that. Here they are. These be going on the yellow bus. All right, so this is Scott's other van. Like I said, it's identical to mine, even the same color. This thing has a Subaru motor in it, it rips. I've actually driven this one, it's pretty fast. But the whole inside interior, this thing is like immaculate and uh, pretty cool little ride. So if you liked today's video, go ahead and get a thumbs up and subscribe to see more car content. Thank you so much for watching. Out of